My name is Alessandra Mossa. I'm a first year PhD student in urban and regional development at Politecnico and Università di Torino. In this short video, I'll introduce my research on post-asylum geographies of madness. With post-asylum geographies, I mean all the spaces of mental health care born in the wake of the madhouse undergoing closure. My main focus will be Italy and the process of deinstitutionalization that has taken place since the so-called Legge Basaglia, in 1978. Since then, we've seen a series of practices emerging, each one characterized by a different set of discursive, embodied and affective dimensions. Special practices that I aim to explore through the everyday and embodied lives of the users, including myself, that have experienced madness outside the walls of the asylum. This way they aim to build up a situated and practiced microgeography of mental health care that puts the human and everyday struggle at the center of its inquiry. The core of my study will be an ethnographic fieldwork conducted in Torino across a series of spaces of mental health care or absence of it that go from drop-in centers to supported accommodation. This carried out by participant observation, autoethnography and live story interviews. Personal stories and special biographies will provide insight on where madness is created, how it is perceived, when it is instead a mere product of cultural direct violence. My study questions then how power, from above and below, has been transformed in post-asylum geographies of care, how it is constructed, performed, narrated, which coping mechanisms are put in place on a daily basis which are the spatial, rhetorical and relational elements that are likely to create dynamics of isolation and what, vice versa, could promote a sense of belonging, self-determination and resistance. Through a study of the everyday struggle for stability of people that live in a precarious psychological state, I will turn madness in one of the possible lenses through which we can look at practices for inhabiting precarity and unequal social power relationships.